Uh, I do want to point out, Codison actually is the uh, CSD record holder across LCS bot laners. Uh, but it's been pretty good for his Venom Smoothie so far in the early game. Now Vulcan rooted, ignited. He's going to go down a straight up two on two first blood. Safer approach, certainly. And, and Zero obviously wants to make certain that he is going to get a kill with that first ultimate. So we'll hold on to it. Still chunking down right here. Nice Drake pick up there. So much pressure down here for TSM, and it's working. And now on the top side, Huni, forced ult to push back Broken Blade, does so. Yeah, that's actually a really good job there by Broken Blade because he still has his ultimate. So now you have that ult advantage for a potential 1v1 fight. But Lyra, as he has now third straight game, gets the early Herald, will drop it, and they have Demolish, mind you, again, on this Tristana. So that is just gone. And again and again and again, Clutch Gaming first turret of the game. I do think, at least in the 1v1, it's very unlikely to get one on Demonte. He has so much self heal with the Buster shot, you know, as well as that rocket jump. Um, but, you know, if he can actually combine up with some people, they could make something happen. Jason move around. Second plate drops him in the top lane as the bot lane turret was already taken out by the TSM duo. So it's still Zven and Smoothie doing most of the work here for TSM. Look at the lane, feeling the punishment right now. But there's a start of the front line. The rest of the squad is there. The charm, the knock of the kill. Lyra goes down. Two to zero, TSM. I have your answer, Azale. I'm here with the Akali as well as the Aatrox. Or if he's going to try to maximize damage a little bit more, you know, with the Shiv or Rapid Fire, which is so popular in pro play. And right now we're seeing a lopsided map. TSM send multiple members up to the top side to get that turret. And Clutch answer with a mid push and a bottom push. Huni on the Azir, you can see at the turret and bottom side, is trying to get that objective back. TSM got the turret on the top side, and this will be the payment for Clutch. Yeah, Clutch, you know, they're able to get some damage on mid turret. They're going to take the bot turret, and they're set up for this dragon. So this is going to be a potential fight here. Dragon spawning now. Bjergsen is roaming out there. He's running straight from base. Just got the Oblivion Orb. So it is going to be very, very strong for this fight. First big team fight of the game. The one that TSM needs to win down 0-2 in this series. They grab the Skarner Spire as well, making Lyra's life harder. Bjergsen waiting in the wings. There's the first stun. There's the hard engage. And the shotgun and a bulk at the very start. The re-engage looks towards Lyra. Hello. Huni. That's low HP. Huni on the wing. Demonte on the sides as well. And Huni's going to push back Bjergsen. But now Broken Blade. Pass one the rest of the squad. Still slowed down. Trying to run out. But... Only at 1,000 HP does make his way out of this one. Bjerg oh. burning the rest of the ultimate. But now Demonte wants into this one. The Shroud push the back into the squad. And that's oh. the alley oop they needed. So what a pickup. Demonte sees Bjergsen use the second half of the ultimate on Akali. Knows the execute won't be there. And Rocket jumps in for the Tristana sec into the. <laughs> I think you've just ruined victory right, for me, Freak. Banana and Blackberry? Okay. Oh, oh, oh. oh, rocket jump gets that way. Nice bust out as well. Good save by Demonte. And a stun prevents the re-engage, but Lyra maybe not stopped right now. Dum -dum. He wants to smite in. He's still running forward. Slowed down by Spika. Just cannot find the ultimate. Just barely pushed away. Look at that good kiting from TSM. All the slows. No QSSs have actually been purchased up by TSM. Whereas we saw QSS rush from Smoothie last time uh -oh. and the QSS rush from Bjergsen is. Holds back, Just broken engaged. blade, pull back in, but without burning flash, you can't get back into that. Because you're giving up too much damage potential. It's too much itemizing towards Justice Smoothie. Q this time was ready around. Speaking of the sun, but here comes Smoothie back line. Finds a bit of a charm, but pulled back in. And they don't have the damage. He jumps back to safety, but Ignite is enough. And they get the kill anyway. Now Lyra in the mix, right against Broken Blade, who's trying to run away. They got Bjergsen for safety, and they are going to stay alive. But still, that Demonte's one kill. Demonte's pushing too. That was a 5v4. They get killed. Demonte will take a tower. That, that was a crazy outplay right there. Lyra audits, and they did not pay. 4v4. Trying to find the stun. Vulcan's low. One more shot, dumping in, Bjergsen finds a sick play, takes down one kill. Finds the angle there during that time. Demonte does get the tower yeah, on. That was really clean from Bjergsen, and you can actually activate your ultimate at any point during the shuriken flips. You don't have to fully connect with it. Uh, makes for those super smooth plays. Yeah, 800 individual gold on him. They're circling in. Oh, that's a pull on the speak. It pushed him back now with the zero as well, and more crowd control on the stopwatch. Buys a few seconds, but no ult, no flash, no way out, and Hooney claims that kill. Could it be Baron again? Nice fight, fight. It's a 4v5. TSM desperately needs to go their way. A knock up onto Hooney. He's going to put this thing forward. There's the ult. They found the suppression. There's a lot of space built by Smoothie, and it's a one for one so far, too. It's going to be a trade. Now it's a four, sorry, three versus two on the fight. Demonte cutting away. Broken Blade gets the healing. The re engage. Sven pops off for the Quadra. Will it be all five? Is Demonte oh, running? Penta kill for Sven! Penta kill! Oh, that 
point. Cody's son, first death in seven games, finally does fall. TSM looking to dive. Oh, damage on the Lyra. The knockout is there. This is the kind of dive TSM wanted. And the road to the reverse sweep is certainly paved with gold now, as they've now got 10 to 5 in kills, a million items on this vent. Mid lane tier 2 gonna drop. And now in the driver's seat, TSM needed to push forward. Uh, we'll see if Clutch can delay later in the game. Demonte's damage must also be respected. Infinity Edge has now been completed. So Justana sitting on those three items. Uni is on two. Cody Sun sitting on two and a half. So there is an incredible amount of power still in this Clutch squad, despite the fact that TSM is now ahead and feeling a lot more comfortable. They also have to be careful about the fact that they don't have a lot of QSSs still. So that can get turned around. Clearer does not die instantly and actually gets an ult off on a Bjergsen or even Broken Blade, you can get focused oh, down. He's got Teleport ready, could join the rest of the team, but the Baron buff about to run out might put a stop to their siege. All right, again, some the focus one to dive. Here comes the engage, a big stun, the knockup. They were to knock down Hootie, and another kill coming across as Lero drops as well. TSM may have just found the dive they needed. That was a huge ult from Spika. Hootie was going in for the stream, a shuffle, but got stuffed by the Sejuani, and they're looking to end it. 5v3, even with Baron buff off, oh, might have the play. But yeah, look at that. Silver wave clear, Justana wave clear. Looking pretty good. They go to the mid lane instead. This time they have the wave, and they might just knock down the turret. Demolish helps with that one. And indeed, you can see Clutch Gaming willing to pull a little bit farther back and maybe live to fight another day. TSM though so far ahead, they are absolutely poised to win this. And the craziest thing about this game is that basically the entire goal lead is actually just Sven. He's, they know TSM started this one. They know, though, that it's not all five. They have to respect the rest Lyra of the squad. Lyra does flash. And again, looking for the play. Lyra runs forward. 4,000 health on the Baron. Doesn't get stunned. This could be the re-engagement. Lyra smoothie. smoothie! Over the wings. Looks for the play. Finds a massive charm. Pulled back in, and Sven is already legendary. They will trade one for one, but the kills might be more important. Hootie buys his face. Clutch trying to run away. But look out for the kills. Pierce to the back line. Pops the stop oh! one. Big root for Sven. And Lyra's gonna be next. This is the fight. Only one shutdown comes through, but the Monte is gone as well. And that's all she wrote. The ace and TSM push right into the base. TSM will not be denied. Bjergsen and Sven both with big flash ultimates in there to finish off those extra kills. And we're going to get some more games. We are going to get some more games. This one's absolutely going to TSM. No chance for Clutch to defend this one. The turrets will fall, and our series will go to game four. TSM to start the reverse sweep. Vulcan to try his hardest, and he just cannot do enough. The next is open. Broken Blade will deal the damage. Bjergsen to help out as well with the KDA. And 18 to 8, we're going to game four.